So after turning it on, we're going to press the menu button. Then we're going to go to number six, recorder. And some of the settings are already set, so I'm just going to be highlighting them. See, wave poly under record to CF. Then we go to four and five, and they're actually already set, so we don't need to set them. But I'm scrolling to them anyway. And then we go back with the menu button to do part two. And we go to the take list from the main menu. And then, so we're going to take list number one under file storage. Now see the edit button to enter the edit. We click this little button to the right because you can see everything's on the right there. So we click that. We go down to scene with the black right knob and we add entry by clicking in the knob and then we'll write in the scene. This will make more sense when we're in class. And then to go back or to accept, we press the little edit button on the bottom right, the little silver thing. Now we're going to press the menu button once, actually twice. Okay, now we're going back twice to go to file storage, and then we're choosing folder options. And choosing the top one, which is top level. And we're going to add a new entry with a black knob on the right, but it on this video it's actually full, so we couldn't add a new one, but it's going to be very similar to what we previously added for the other entry. And we also need to set mid-level daily. It's already set, but we need to make sure mid-level set to daily. Now Part three, time code. Time code is number seven in the main menu. And we're going to go to time code mode, which is number one, choose free run. Number two, frame rate. We wanna make sure that's 2398 for this setup. And then number five, set generator time code or set ge generator TC for time code, which is number five. And we set the time to the exact time to the second. Then we click the black button, we jam it. Now we want to plug in our time code the locket box, turn it on, make sure it's plugged in, and we go to number four, jam menu. This is jamming the time code into our locket box. Jamming, and you can see the green lights on both the recorder and the locket box, and we're good to go.